Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Um, my career pick is X-ray technician by Juan Aguilar. Uh, I'm here to talk to you guys about how I chose this because this field really interests me and it's something I want to finish and pursue as I'm doing my college. And this is something that I think you guys are gonna enjoy. Next slide. Okay, this is a quote I picked saying, X-ray, Crystallography is nowadays an accurate and rapid method of determining confirmation in the crystal lattice, which is confirmation usually corresponds to the preferred confirmation in solution. This is a, a Nobel Prize chemist who inspired me to follow this career because it's something I want to do. Like I said before, you know, I like it and I want to do it. Next slide. Uh, these are the schools that if you wanted to feel, uh, follow my career or my steps into what do you want to do with this. The school the best for this would be Loma Linda University, which is located in Southern California. Uh, another great school would be Ferris State University, located in Northwestern Michigan. Another one would be the University of Hartford, which is in West Hartford. Um, another part about this field that you have to be certified and get your own licenses and you know you gotta pay for that and you know get insured by the state so you can get approved so you can work here in the state of New Jersey. Next one. This is a picture of my cover letter. I wrote to a doctor. His name is Dr. Ben Johnson. He works in a radiology clinic in Christ Hospital. This is my recommendation to him uh, I'm writing that I really am interested in a position over there in Christ Hospital like this would be a good example of a job that would have to do with my you know my career in the near future if I want to start in a hospital that would be like a good first step and next one. this is my resume these are my three jobs I worked in BJ's wholesale club I worked in the optical vision I worked in Pediatric uh, clinic office. Um, I went to St. Peter's. I graduated from North Bergen High School. I'm in Hudson right now, trying to finish my, trying to get an associate's by next semester. Then I want to follow by two more years of studying to get a bachelor's, and you know keep going more and afterwards. And I want to stop a bachelor's. I want to get a, a master's afterwards. So I would have to do in reality six more years of school so I can get to where I want to be in life. Uh, these are some classes, curriculums that if you want to follow in this career to become an extra technician, you would have to do biology classes, you would have to do math courses, you have to do sociology, English courses, you have to maintain at least a GPA of a 2.5. questions my major is radiology it's my own personal achievement I want to finish it after researching my career options I found out that not a, a lot of universities have this major in their schools or inside the curriculums either so it's a really like a tight career that nobody picks a lot but I picked it out of my own personal game because I want to do it and not be like everybody else who's like copying to be like a doctor or a dentist because it's too long, you get me? And I don't want to do that. I want to finish, you know, quick, get it done, you know, get my own degree, get my own certificate, my own license, you know, get it done. Um, at the bottom right here is a quote where it says, No man succeeds without a good woman behind him, wife or mother. If it is both, he is twice blessed indeed. That was by Godfrey Wynn. And that's it. That's my presentation. Thank you, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you.